Let's see how easily we can add new software or icons to our BlackBerry. This is also known as over-the-air installation or OTA for short. There are thousands of applications out there from games to news feed readers to great productivity applications for your BlackBerry and most of them can be installed wirelessly using this method. One note, if you received your BlackBerry from your organization then you may not be permitted to install anything on your BlackBerry. If you do find you're having trouble with this process, go ahead and check with your help desk or technology support team for assistance. Let's get started. In order to download software, you first need to get to a web page that has BlackBerry software designed for your model BlackBerry and compatible with your BlackBerry system software version. That's the version of the software running on your particular BlackBerry. I'll show you a few of the more popular ways to get started finding software for your BlackBerry. The first option is to go into your web browser. You can see I have my browser icon highlighted here and I just click on it. Now in my web browser I can actually go ahead and type the web address here of where I'm going. But in some web browsers and some Blackberries you actually have to hit the menu key first and then select the menu item that says go to and then you'll be able to type in your web address. Here, let's just type in one that I know has good games for the BlackBerry from Magmic, M-A-G-M-I-C, and then space, C-O-M. The space gives me the dot, and then just click on that. And now you can see here I'm at the home screen, and you can look around for different uh, buy or get. The get, in this case, allows you to do a free trial. So if we clicked on that, we would get to a screen here that would show the device model. In this case we're running a 9000. You would pick your device model. And remember to check out what device you're using. You have to go into your options screen on your BlackBerry home screen and then select about and you'll see the actual model number of your BlackBerry. Let's scroll over here to our model which happens to be 9000. In some cases you'll get to a screen like this which says there is no software available for your BlackBerry type. So let's take a look at another method to get to a different website. In this case I'm going to hit the menu key and here you see the go to menu item that I mentioned before. Select that and now we'll type in another software vendor. Vigo makes a newsreader for your BlackBerry. And here you see we've gotten to a website that allows us to download the software. So we'll go ahead and click that link there. And click again here. And now we get to a screen that is the over-the-air or wireless download screen. This screen looks pretty much the same on every single BlackBerry model. If everything looks good, you go ahead and click download. And now at the end of the download, you'll see a screen that looks like this. A lot of times you just click run. And then depending on the software, you may see some licensing agreements. Click OK. Depending on the type of application, you may need to do some setup screens. So we'll hit the escape key a few times. And let's go look for that new icon we just installed. We don't see it on our home screen, so we'll hit the menu key. And in our particular BlackBerry, we have a downloads folder down here near the bottom. And that's where it is. So if we click on that, it'll start up the application and we hit the escape key to get back out. Now if you prefer to get to the download page using your web browser, for instance for this application Vigo, what we could do is use our web browser to go to the Vigo site on our computer and if you see over here you can actually just type in your email address and have a link email to you that you just click on in your BlackBerry email or in the direct download you could type in this web address inside your BlackBerry browser. Either way will get you right to that downloads page. So let's take a look on our BlackBerry at the email. You'll get an email similar to this one which will have a link in it and as soon as you click that link watch what happens. 
You can skip all that searching around for web applications. You can just click on the download Vigo link and you're right back to this page where you can download. So in some cases, doing some web searching and looking for software that's compatible with your BlackBerry using your computer's web browser might be a little faster to find the right link and the right version. So that's it for how to download software and install it directly on your BlackBerry. Thanks for watching and listening.